Good morning everyone, it's Lisa with Power Wash Store of Central PA. I'm going to give you a little quick walk around here of our most recent build. Um, the customer is coming to pick this one up today, so I want to give you a quick look here. This one is a 14 foot flat bed. They had a custom aluminum bed put on here. And then we added some soft washing and pressure washing equipment. Um, what you see here is one of our mid-size soft washing skin. This is an air diaphragm setup. You see our 20 CFM compressor here. Up on top there is a fuel tank that's going to feed the engine of that compressor. And then you can see there are, I don't know if you can see from the video, but there are actually two half inch Yamada pumps up there. Um, they're not working together. The one is just serving as a backup. So some, if something happens to that first Yamada pump, you're just going to quickly change your hoses over to the second one and you'll be back up and spraying again in no time. On the skid here, we also have our proportioning system. And then back in the back behind there, there are three soap tanks. We have a manifold system for filling up those soap tanks. And then in the back is your 100 gallon tank for bleach and a 100 gallon tank for water. Um, that red line that's coming down there and going through the deck, well, there's actually two red lines that are going through the deck. The first one here is just our dump tube for the air compressor. Um, these air compressors need to be emptied every day, so we want to make that as easy as possible. So you're just going to open up those ball valves, and the tanks will drain quickly. The second one back there is going to be our bleach vent. So we just have a hose barb that's going through the lid of the, uh, of the tank with a hose connected to it, and then the vapors are just going to gas out below the truck here. Next we have our water tanks for the pressure washer. Uh, they are our 200 gallon, or I'm sorry, two 200 gallon tanks giving us a total of 400 gallons capacity for our uh, pressure washer here. Two fuel tanks and then back here is our hot water unit. This is an 8 gallon a minute water dragon gear drive unit. Uh, it has the Honda 690 on it. Uh, these units also come with the heat exchangers. So that exhaust is going to go right back into the coil. We also remove the thermostat here so it's accessible over the key, right by the key start of the engine just uh, so you can easily turn that thermostat. And then the control panel for that hot water unit is back here with the indicator lights and the one-off switch. We have five Titan hose reels here. There's a mix between electric and hand crank. Uh, that was just a customer's choice. Uh, top hose reel there with the red hose. That's going to be our soft washing hose. We have 250 feet Next to it. We have some garden hose The lower hose reel has our 3 8 hose Which is going to work with our water purification system, which I'll get to in a minute And then the bottom two reels are going to be for pressure washing line, which the customer is going to unload his own hose And then we have our water purification system here this is one of the RHG Tucker four stage RODI systems. This does have the onboard booster pump, so it can draw right from the tank. It also has the TDS meter, so you can always see what the quality of your water uh, that you're using for window cleaning. Easy on and off switch. And this unit is a 12 volt system, so it's just hooked right up to the battery, so you don't have to worry about having to plug it in or charge batteries or anything. That battery will always stay charged. So again, this is Lisa with Power Wash Store PA, just giving you a quick walk around of one of our most recent builds. If you're looking to have a build something like this or something completely different, uh, we'd hope you consider us for a chance to build that for you. Give me a call and we can talk about all of your options. 717-378-2276. Thanks for watching and have a great day.